Good morning, student. Today we are going to continue our chapter. A new chapter we are going to start. A new chapter that is chapter fifteen, constructions. So, construction basically that in geometric construction means drawing up correct and accurate figure from the given data. Our data is given to you. You have to draw the accurate figure. So this is all about the geometry. So have you seen this? What is this? It is a compass, and you have also familiar with this. This is a ruler, or in simple land term, we call it a scale. So these are the things by which you can draw the things in the constructions. So these are the basically things which are used in the construction. First construction of a line segment. So we will dis we will discuss about the construction of line segment. How can line segment be constructed? First, using a ruler. Using a ruler. Ruler means the ruler means our scale. So, with the help of a scale, you can draw the line. Suppose, if you want to draw any of the line, what you are going to do? You are put the scale on the table on your uh, sheet like this, and with the zero initial position, put a mark. Here, you can put a mark on the initial position in the zero position, and suppose you want to draw the Line of six centimeter. So where is six? So here is the six. You can put this and draw the line. So we can say that this point A and point B, A B. This length is of six centimeter. So in this way you can use a ruler by using a line. So in your book we have seen here. This is the ruler. You can put the scale over this point. Initial point that is the zero point, and suppose you have to draw the line of four point six centimeter on the scale. This is four. This is one, two, three, four, five, four point five, and this is point six. So you put a dot over there, and then you can draw the line. In this way, you can draw the line of four point six centimeter. So here on the board we have drawn the line of six centimeter with the help of a scale by putting the scale. Initial position taking the initial position zero position. This is your initial position zero position, and this is your six centimeter. So with the help of the ruler, you can draw the line. Next thing is using a compass. We can draw the line using a compass. With the help of compass, we can draw the line. So with the help of compass, we draw compass is very much similar to a divider. So the difference is that is the pointed second arm. It is the screw attached to the hold the pencil here. We can attach. This is the divider. In the divider, this arm and this arm both the same arm. But in the compass, this point you can hold your pencil. But in this, we can hold the chalk. But at your divider, you can hold the pencil. So What you are going to do? You are going. You are going to draw a line. A line of just. You have to draw a line segment like this. Initial position. Draw. You have draw the line. Suppose you have draw the line. See. Y or P, you can say that we can draw the P line. So now, if we draw a, we have to draw a line of three centimeter. Three centimeter. What you are going to do? You are going to open the compass in this in this manner, and where it goes three, one tip at the zero point, and another tip at tip at this three centimeter. So when you open this like this. It will be three centimeter. You have taken the arc of three centimeter without disturbing this. You can initial position 
at this and draw a arc like this. We can draw a arc. We can put a point over here, initial point, and we are drawing a arc. So what the arc is going to put in this B and the initial position we have taken A. So this is of 3 centimeter. This is of 3 centimeter. In this way, you can draw the line using a compass. What you are going to do? You are going to drawing a, a line segment of P that is shown in your figure like this. You have draw a line P segment that we have drawn line segment P over there then what will happen draw the metallic point with the compass on ruler point zero we have taken the this this metallic point on the our, our ruler zero position and then we draw a line segment of three centimeter either you can draw the line segment of three centimeter or you can take the line segment of three centimeter we have taken the line segment here we have taken this as a three centimeter and then we put here initial position and then we put a arc so metallic compass of the compass on the zero point of the ruler and open it out such as pencil point is 3.6 cm we have taken the here 3 cm without changing the distance that we have already seen we don't change the distance and place the metallic point on A and cut off an arc we have, point, we have placed on that point A and we have put a arc so this arc, this is our arc over there which we have draw with the help of our compass so this AB is the required segment in your book the AB is 3.6 here we have draw the AB of 3 cm so in this way we can draw the line segment using the compass now straight what is your homework for today is You have to do exercise 15.1. You have to do question 1 and question 2 of exercise 15.1. One more important thing, students, when you are doing this question, question 1 and question 2. You have to write the steps also. You have to write the steps also. The steps means what you are doing, what you are constructing. If you are drawing a line, drawing a line AB, you have to draw point one, draw line AB AB or segment, draw a line segment AB of three centimeter or so. Or if you are uh, cutting an arc, you have to write all this thing in your copy. Is that clear to you? So you have to write the step also. First you have to draw. First you have to draw a term. Suppose this is your copy. First you have to draw and then at the end you have to write the steps also. Thank you students.